What's going on? How y'all doing? Alright. What's up, people? Welcome to an episode of the Freeform Anime Podcast. Nah, this ain't Freeform Anime Podcast. Or is it? Who knows? <laughs> Who knows? <laughs> Who knows? Who knows? <laughs> oh, man. But, um, yeah. I know uh, it's been a minute since we did one of these videos discussing, like, anime. Because I said, I told y'all we were going to do this. So you can't be shocked. But um, one of the recent things that just came out was Castlevania came out what, a few weeks ago. Uh, what are your thoughts on it, Henry Neutron? It was cool. Just way too fucking short. That's all I got to say about that. Like, it was cool. I feel like, I get why everybody likes it. Now, if you don't know uh, what Castlevania is, Castlevania, the, the anime is basically, it's based on the um, the gaming franchise, but more specifically based on the third game. I think it was Dracula's Curse. Mm -hmm. And uh, it follows, like, the games follow the um, main character who, who is from a descendant of, like, demon hunters, vampire hunters, and basically they're here to stop Dracula from wiping out the world. Same instance is still in the anime, but what makes this cool to me is because I don't know if you caught like just not this has nothing to do with the plot, but these it had the same animation, the same animation and art styles of like uh Last Avatar, like Korra, the yeah. Legend of Korra, mm -hmm. and like it reminded me of Boondocks a little bit. That's the Boom only Man thing that I didn't like about it. Actually. Why? Because it's like my thing is like if like this is the thing that I don't like about Americanized animes or American cartoons that are technically animes. Is that uh <laughs> Go ahead. <laughs> is that uh like my thing is like man don't I the otaku in me, I'm not even gonna fucking play around like I am in a in a, in a otaku, like I'm not a fucking weeaboo. <laughs> I, I check you myself you got, you got that far but but I am an otaku and parts of me is like okay America if you're gonna do the anime game then do the fucking anime game like like and I, I'm not talking about the actual game for the audience like I mean like if you're gonna be a part of this craft you're gonna be a part of this genre then be a part of that fucking genre I get that you wanna try to appeal to the American aspects of cartoons with uh with the with the with an audience, like an American audience, I get that, but at the same time, I'm like, bruh, like, there's nothing wrong with making that shit look like Yu Yu Hakusho or Yu-Gi-Oh or anything else, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's a, if it's fucking dope, like, the thing about me is like, yeah, I understand that a lot of people get into it for, like, the art design of the anime or the manga or the comic book or the cartoon, but the thing that is important to me is the fucking plot. What made Avatar so good was the plot. I mean, you say, are you saying Castlevania had no plot? No, I'm not saying oh. that at all. I'm just saying, like, what I'm saying is, like, if we're gonna... I wish they didn't do that design. Because the plot was good enough that you could have literally had stick figures on the fucking screen. <laughs> like, oh, see, that, that's what we differ. I actually like it, because I think that animation and art style kind of, it started here if not here then we kind of made it our own which i like okay from that aspect i got yeah so i'm like i like that we're doing our own thing if if not in america europe wherever i like i like that it's different than the types of anime really used to watch it right now mm -hmm. and like the fact that i and like for me personally with boondocks came i love their fight scenes in boondocks <laughs> It was dope. So good. Especially the Bushido Brown and the... Uh, See, I felt like Boondocks was a cartoon that had themes of anime in it. I call it anime. <laughs> I, 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 never, I, like, I, I never considered I had to, it anime. I, ever since the dodgeball, the kickballs, I was like, you know what? I, that I, I would I would the game, man? That's I, like I, season three. Yeah, I'm like, dude, I would watch that. I mean, about, even, even this fight was Oga Ruckus. No, in, my, in, my in, favorite uh, episode is uh, Attack of the Killer Kung Fu Wolf Bitch. Oh, yeah. <laughs> the girl that had, uh, they had Pam's the Pam's voice. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The Kumite. Yeah. The Kumite. <laughs> <laughs> but, yeah. That shit was dope. But, yeah, back to Castlevania. Okay, just a brief rundown of the plot. Like, the plot is very simple. Um, It's simple, but it's the way it's being told. Like, with a lot of good stuff. Good example was Last of Us. It was kind of a cliche story, but it was, like, the way it was told and presented to you that made it great. Yeah. So, for Castlevania, basically, the whole plot line... Old Man Logan? I fucking love Old Man Logan. Old Man Last of Us? <laughs> I didn't even watch that movie. What, Old Man Logan? I, nah, I haven't watched Logan. It's just Logan. Yeah, well, I, I'll call it Logan. I'll call it Last of Us, but... Uh, 
But um, Castlevania's plotline deals with Dracula, and then this iteration of Dracula. We, I said it was already based on the third game, but Dracula, when you first meet him in the beginning of the um series, he's pretty much done with everything humanity. He's not to the point where he's like trying to like eradicate everybody. He's just basically keeping to himself. Meets a young woman who is an aspiring doctor who's trying to like bring forth like a renaissance of medicine to the world. And she's basically trying to do good for humankind. Um, events happen which lead Dracula to go on this vengeful, bloodthirsty quest of just complete eradication of the world. Yeah. And like once you like when you start when you watch it and you see his motivations, for me personally, I could fault him. I couldn't fault him yeah, at all. I was, I, I, was, I was, I was like, I can understand what would take you to that point because I can understand if that happened to me. What lengths I would be willing to go. Yeah. And the way he went about it was so cold too. <laughs> yeah. This man became a ball of fire, a ball of fire that came down, said like some cold shit, just like, listen, you got a year to get your shit together, <laughs> make peace with yourself. It was out. I was like, oh, okay. Like, my thing is, like, the only problem that I actually have with the storyline is, like, because I because I know about Castlevania, like, the video game series. My bad. I'm probably talking low as fuck right now. Because <laughs> I know that I'm talking uh, that, uh, about the Castlevania series and shit, and, like, the storylines of those and the different versions of them and shit like that, it's, like, those game plots weren't that good. I mean, it was simple. It was, uh, it was simple as fuck. But and it, I feel like when you come to like when it comes to like anime, like you gotta ramp up the story. And I feel like they didn't do it enough for me personally. But I'm not mad at the show. At the I, end I, of the I, day. I would, I would, answer, I, would, I, would I would tell you. This. That's why I wanted I, more episodes. Yeah, I, I'll give like, you, I'll give you an opinion on that. I think they did it because I don't think they knew how well it was gonna do. Because when it first dropped, like when I first saw, it, I saw. I think when I was at work, I just happened to be on Twitter on break. And, like, I saw a trailer for Castlevania on Netflix. I was like, what? And then, I like, right when I got home, I went to Netflix. I think it crashed the server, like, right when it came out. It was the day it released. Yeah, that might be due to... Uh, never mind. I'll talk about it off air. Oh, God. <laughs> um, but, um... But I think, I think that they wanted to test the waters because, like you said, Castlevania, unless you, like, a real gamer and you have some gaming knowledge and gaming history, you're not gonna know what Castlevania. You're not gonna know Castlevania. You, you, if they would have called it like Dracula Those games or something, were or something obscure but, yeah. as fuck back when <laughs> they were, <laughs> were popular. Like, like when they were popular, they were obscure yeah, as fuck. Because like I never played, but my cousin like, because I live when I like go, you go to your cousin's house, you play whatever they're playing, or mm -hmm. you watch play whatever. You got no option. Yeah, he had Castlevania. Like he still had the NES when I, I used to go over there. He would play. He would play through it. I'd be like. Oh, this kind of interesting. It was like kind of hard because this cat was just super, slow and super it hard. It was clunky, dude. but it had it had a, it had a like it had a mystique. It had a lore to it, and like I think that's what that drew everybody in the Castlevania is the lore mm -hmm. of like Dracula yeah. demons. Yeah, and like once you bring in Dracula, you have a whole like you have a like, whole bunch of possibilities. Castlevania may be like. the first Castlevania may be the first place where the name Alucard is mentioned. And then you got Helsing, where his name is Alucard, yeah. but it's Dracula backwards, basically. And so it's like, yeah, I can understand the mystique and the intrigue behind the game itself and shit like that or whatever. And like, I don't know, like people, like I, I was happy that it came out because I'm like, yo, you birthed so many genres, like you birthed so many genres, like. And it's like the you don't get that, like, Dance of the Vampire Bun without fucking Castlevania in my, I actually, in like, my world. I like love you Dance don't the get Vampire that Bun. anime without this game. Like you don't get there. They well, also they could have did more with that anime. Dance they could have done way more. Because <laughs> I, I read the manga and like the way the man. Dude gets like gets right. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's all right. But back to Castlevania. We'll talk about that later. But um, <laughs> back to Castlevania. Um, yeah, like you said, I think I think it's opened up new doors and like new possibilities. I think a lot of people that that just like basically just went and watched it on a whim were like, I like this. When season two come out, but here's how I think they could have extended season one. You could have went back because you know how Trevor Bellman was saying like his fans basically ate, like yeah. chased and, and killed. Yeah, man, like erasing the bloodline. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You could like built that up, just like you could have built up his motivation, so he didn't just seem like a sarcastic prick all the time, which was his charm, yeah. by the way. But you could have like 
went into his family history, like see how Simon went through this or how his father was going through all this and what was going on with their family. Like in and also like elaborate on like Dracula and Alucard during that time. Cause I yeah. think well Alucard is still young because I think he was still like what? Um he couldn't been no more. He he him and Trevor were about the same age. Yeah. So But I'm saying you could have went through what Dracula was doing then because he was already known to be like a great evil force there, but he just stopped. Yeah. Like what made him stop? That that that's what I'm saying. That's yeah, how you could extend the season they one. Could've that done, they could have done a lot with that. But I, I see, I see them. They were just trying to test the waters yeah. and see, like, will this fly? Yeah, like because like they're, they're spending like Netflix is spending a lot of money for a lot of big budget and shit. Like, and, so and I ain't understand. Been, and all ain't been trash either. Like they're getting it back on the investment. It ain't. It ain't, and so it's like, I get why they would want to test the waters. I get why they would want to take their time with something and build it up. But four episodes, like you could at least give me six. Like BBC, <laughs> you will feed it. You will BBC, feed it. <laughs> BBC gives me six episodes at least. God damn, like come on, son. Like yeah, you're I, give me four. I'm like, not gonna lie. When I, when I finished, when I, yeah, when I finished it, when like, I finished what? it, it was like y'all just get help. Y'all leaving on the best part. What like happened, baby, I thought we were cool. <laughs> You see, these cats march out the water. I'm like, oh, man, it's going down. Then I look, because I didn't even look at how many episodes it was when I started yeah, watching yeah. it. And then I started, I like, I was like, okay, episode four done. I'm like, all right, man, let's go I was ahead. Gonna, I, I gave it a try. Like, I was like, all right, cool. Like, I'm going to put this on. I'm going to take a nap. If I wake up and I wake up and see some lit shit, then, yeah, cool. I'm going to go back and watch it. Man, I woke up. That bitch said... <laughs> other series like this or whatever and I was like nigga what how that shit end so fast and then I checked it and I was like four episodes are you shitting me I can't like, believe you slept through the first when you first watched it no I, was, I slept through the first episode I didn't I liked it it, like, it caught me because I, I guess because I, I'm I, such I, a fan I of the lore the, I played the games and shit yeah. like growing up so I mean I like, didn't for real I, I was like whatever but when you bring in like to me when you bring in Dracula Wolfman or like werewolves or uh, um so, like any other like Knightley, um, I mean uh, what's her name um, fuck what's that chick's name from fucking uh, what's the Rise of the Lichens what's the name of oh, the oh Kate um Katie Beckinsale Be- no. yeah Be- I think it's yes no, it can't oh, be her it can't be oh, her we, we have the internet good stuff we, we can I can't remember the name of that movie series right now you talking about Underworld Underworld yeah, yeah, I like I like Underworld. Underworld is cool. I like the first movie. Second one was I I haven't watched. Well, how many they got? It? How many they got? It's they got like five right now, nigga. Like, okay, I think I, I think I stopped after the last good one. <laughs> I think I think that's what happened. All of them are good. Cause, cause in their own way. No, because Michael good. left. I ain't know what happened to Michael. And like she had a Fuck daughter. Michael. We don't need Michael. Fuck you. I need <laughs> that. He was wrong. We he was wrong. Man. What's her name? What's her name? Uh, we got we got a. Uh, Hold on, people. I'm gonna tell you who we got in a minute. But yeah, um, other than that, man, I've just been reading a lot of manga. <clears throat> I've been reading um, My Hero Academia, of course, One Piece. Uh, yeah, you keep going, man. I ain't uh, found it yet. Of course, um, Fairy Tale just ended. Like, I want to say Fairy Tale ended this week or last week. It was pretty cool. I wasn't mad at it. I was not mad at that at all. I, I, I stopped. It was like... Oh, yeah. Let's, we'll finish the thoughts on Castlevania. I, 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 I think suggest Castlevania you know, is cool. Yeah. I, you know, I, I did. I did. And um, yeah, it's, it's, it's a short enough up. season that, like, that if you want to go rewatch it, you can rewatch it anytime. Yeah. Just carve out a little time of your day, whatever. Just watch a couple minutes of it. You'll be through with it before you know it because it's only four fucking episodes. Yeah, and it's I'm basically not saying an hour and a half. So. Yeah, like I'm not even complaining about that because the episodes were lengthy. It was about thirty. Well, no, they were they were like the like an average episode of like Dragon Ball Super. It was like it seemed longer to me for some reason. I guess because they took their time with the story. I don't yeah. know, but it seemed longer for some reason. But I wasn't mad at it. I was I was only mad at it being four episodes, but outside of that, it, I have I have nothing to complain about with that. Like I get it because I know the lore. I get it. I get why people like it. I get why people like the art design of it. I get all that shit. Depends, cause I think I think that they can stretch it. Which looks sexy as hell. Right? Oh my god, you fat son of a bitch. I'm <laughs> as fuck, cause but, uh, you do. <laughs> <laughs> but 
But yeah, uh, same thoughts as uh, Henny. Just like, I'm sorry, uh, watch it. <laughs> you know, watch it. It's, it's worth your time, and then it doesn't take that much out the day. Yeah. But um, I think I think this is really setting up because they got greenlit for like season two. I think like after that weekend it came out. So people was just like, yo. Bring more of this out. Don't you ever do this full episode again? <laughs> yeah. So it was like, all right, they're gonna give. us the only thing that sucks about it is it's eight episodes, six, six, second season. But I think they're gonna. But be we ain't gonna it. get that shit till like a year and a half from now. Like that's the thing that I hate about Netflix originals. It's like <laughs> if you be wanting that shit. Like okay, you mean to tell me that I can watch the whole season in a week? But you gonna take a whole year to fucking give me some more shit? Don't be watching. <laughs> Don't you <laughs> fuck that? That's the whole reason. That's the whole reason Netflix is popping, like because you can binge watch binge shit. Like, but weekends. it makes no sense. Like for me, it makes no sense for you to say, okay, like he's mad, like, he fainted right now. You right? <laughs> <laughs> All over that mouth. Right? It just—it's annoying, man. It's annoying as fuck. But sorry. um. Yeah, uh, go watch it. I don't think it, it takes a year time. and a half for you to like have your own publication and like production company and all that shit or whatever, and your own licensing and all that shit or whatever, and your own fucking contracts for your own actors. And it all depends that shit. on what the series is. Yeah, I'm not done. I'm not done. And your own fucking locations. <laughs> it depends on the series, cause I need. I think Defenders needed that extra time. To get, come on, we know what happened with Iron Fist. And Luke Cage, don't don't and Luke Cage. Don't, don't, don't try to don't try to black pride this. <laughs> Go Black Friday. You know how I feel about Luke Cage. I do. I do. But, but um, that TV show was whack. At first, the first half was dope. After, uh, what was it, Cobra? Uh, King? Cottonmouth. Cottonmouth? Yes. After he left. I mean, the whack. first the first half of the Spoilers. season. Spoilers. Listen, first half of Luke Cage was dope. Second half, could have did without. I wish you would have just said Luke Cage and Iron Fist just came together and created. Like, oh, man, that's been all right. That's a whole other subject. But yeah. Right. Sh- story short. Watch Castlevania. It is very dope. It is very worth your time. Support good stuff. All right. <laughs> it was Kate Beckinsale, nigga. I just said Kate Beckinsale. I didn't hear you. <laughs> I pulled that down it up. I saw you typing and then you went back to talking about something else. Yeah, I pulled it up. It's Kate Beckinsale. I can't remember the joke I was going to say about it. Well, too bad. It's Damn. done. It's done. We ended the video. The video's still going, but hey, we ended it. It's done. <laughs> You're done.